deionizers take minerals out of water. Uh, the water that you get out of your sink is anything but pure. Um, the water that comes out of this deionizing unit is as pure of water as you'll ever find. The ionizing unit is here, and this is called the resin chamber, and this is what actually pulls the uh, minerals out of the water. What we want to do first is to open this top up and make sure that there's water right here. And you'll see that there's a little thing that says pour water here. If that's not near the top, then uh, what you'll need to do is grab this container right here and dump some of the water in where it says pour here. If this container here is empty, talk to your instructor and they'll you, give you a container with pre-filtered water. So the, the, the water will flow out of here, be forced through the uh, deionizing unit up through the bottom, come out the top, and then you'll be using this valve here to get your water. There's going to be a small red switch on the side of my deionizing unit. What you're looking for is values here above 1.3. This is a value in um, electrical resistance. So what the meter here does is it's checking how much current electricity can force through the water. The, the less electricity it can force through, the better your water is. So this value at uh, 1.3 here, that's going to be adequate enough for us. It's uh, changing on us though. As it filters through, it gets water that's been purified and water that hasn't been purified through. Once it's, all the water's been forced through here, our value will definitely be over 1. So now we have 1.88. So when we want to gain water, we simply grab this valve here, have our beaker, and squeeze. And then turn it off when you're finished using it. Make sure that the reservoir level is near the top.